Hey guys, I'm back. Um, this is me, model Laura M. Corbin. And before I start anything, I just want to have you guys all go to Cosplay Underground's YouTube channel and subscribe. And that's spelled with a K. So it's K O S P L A Y. And the second word is underground. And go ahead and subscribe. You can also follow us on Facebook at Cosplay Underground. So in the search bar, just type in K-O-S-P-L-A-Y. Second word is underground. We also have an Instagram account and that is Cosplay Underground Official. All one word, so it's spelled the same way as well. That's K-O-S-P-L-A-Y Underground Official. All one word. So go ahead and do those three things. I'll wait. Okay, are you done? All right, now I gotta plug my page, which is Model Laura M. Corbin. So that's facebook.com slash model L M C. That's facebook.com slash model L as in Laura, M as in Michelle, and C as in cosplay. And I also have an Instagram account, and that's Instagram at model L M C, spelled the same way. So go ahead and do those things. And I am here to do a little interview with you guys. Um, first off, let me show you what I'm wearing. I'm gonna switch the camera around here. So this is me in my Lilu costume. And as you can see, it's kind of beat up right now. I'm going to redo it, and you're probably wondering why I'm not wearing the wig, and that's because the wig took days upon days upon hours to make, to make perfect, and so I don't want to mess it up because I am going to remake this costume, make it perfect, and reshoot it for my modeling page. Also, the back of this isn't finished because I ran out of bandages, which is not good. Eek! Um, anyway, back to the interview. Follow me. I'm going to leave the bathroom now. So, I first got started with cosplay when I was really, really young. I was probably about 10 years old and um, it's my first love. Although now I am a model first, cosplayer, singer, actress, writer, songwriter, and many other things on the side. Um, cosplay was my first love, that's for sure. I started when I was 10, like I said, and what I did was <laughs> I dressed up as one of the members of Sister Sludge, and if you don't know who that is, just Google them, and got together with three other girls, and we ended up singing the song We Are Family for our church. I was painted brown, I had a black wig, and a gold dress, and I immediately fell in love with cosplay. So. From then on out, I always loved to dress up. I would take any chance there was to make a costume or be a character or whatever it was. Um, it was always just my favorite thing in the whole world to do. And now I do it somewhat professionally, which is just the best thing. It's like a dream come true. So um, I've made many costumes. I've made the one that I'm wearing. The Lilu costume, which, uh, like I said before, is going to be remade as I'm a perfectionist and the bandages are too wide. Yes, they're going to be smaller. I know. Um, and it's going to be reshot with a different photographer, not because the first one was bad, but because uh, the second one knows the movie really well and um, is actually very excited to do it. So I'm just looking for... Um, some new experiences. Um, if you go to my page, you can also see in the background here, I have a bunch of different wigs that I've used for different shoots. This one right here 
was used for a dead bride shoot, which was awesome. Um, it's kind of gory and just a character I made up. I've also made in the past, uh, let's see, um, Cora from Tron. I made that costume with um, six hours of hard work and a lot of glow sticks <laughs> um, and a bodysuit, of course. Um, I've also made an Edward Scissorhands costume, which I am remaking because it wasn't perfect. Um, but, you know, anytime I'm creating, I just feel really good about myself and my life. And so that's what cosplay means to me. It means self-expression and um, just being a character for a different day, getting out of yourself and just really acting as that character and, you know, kind of freaking people out sometimes. I really like doing that. <laughs> it's just fun for me to kind of um, give people a little scare or, you know, make them like a kind of afraid to touch me. Um, I've worn a lot of costumes at San Diego Comic-Con International. Uh, I go pretty much every year and I participate in the Masquerade, which is like a, a, a show, like you put it on a skit, everything's handmade. There's a crowd of about 7,000 people and um, the designs that I wear for that are always made by the same woman. Her name is Katherine Fisher and you can find her Facebook page if you search under cat, like the kitty, designs unlimited. She is incredible. Uh, she has made for me um, a Ziggy Stardust costume which looked exactly like the real thing. It was amazing. and. Um, on my page there's an Eon Flux costume and her link is there too but she made that as well and I got to I got the pleasure of wearing it it was amazing it was awesome and um yeah I don't know I don't think there's anything wrong with being sexy in your cosplay because cosplay is sexy um there's really nothing wrong with that I think that Anyone who gives you a hard time about it, they're probably just jealous because, you know, m most people don't have the courage to put on a costume that that maybe makes them look kind of stupid or kind of like putting themselves out there or showing a lot of skin and um, just, just being that character. It's just so much fun and, um, you know. Hate is just jealousy with a mask on it, so take it lightly, everybody, um, and take it as a compliment, because in reality, um, they're just wishing that they could do what you're doing. Um, so I really love cosplay. Uh, I love to create every character, and even in my modeling, um, I create a character for each shoot that I do, and I act that character out. and. A lot of times it's a character I made up. Most of the time it is. But sometimes I get the honor of making a costume or having someone say, hey, can you make this costume? And then I get to wear it in a shoot and that is just freaking awesome. Um, anyway, I don't really know what else to say, but cosplay is very close to my heart and um, it's something I do as kind of an emotional release and I think a lot of you feel the same way. Plus, it's just really fun, and the attention, of course, I'm not going to lie, is definitely part of it. But, you know, there's nothing to be ashamed of. That's really all there is to it. Be proud of who you are, what you look like, your size, your weight, your gender. It doesn't matter. You can dress like a man, you can dress like a woman, you can be whatever you want. And that's really what cosplay is to me. So, I think you've heard enough out of me. It's been almost 10 minutes here. <laughs> Again, don't forget to follow Cosplay at um, the YouTube channel, which is Cosplay Underground. And again, that's K-O-S-P-L-A-Y. And go ahead and subscribe to them. And don't forget to go to their Facebook page, like it. I am the on the cover page. Um, you'll see a Lilu Dallas, and that's me. 
So I have the honor of being on the cover page. And although, yes, I am an admin for Cos Cosplay Underground, I do barely any of the work. So I can't really take credit for what goes on there. I just help out here and there when I can. Um, there are a lot of people behind the scenes who do a lot more than me. A lot more. I just try to help out whenever I can. So Cosplay Underground, look for them on YouTube, or us, I should say, um, and subscribe. Also, follow them on Instagram, follow us on Instagram, at Cosplay Underground Official, and like the Facebook page, which is Cosplay Underground, and um, if you'd be so kind, I would love it if you would go to my page, facebook.com slash model LMC. You can see some of my professional cosplay shoots there, and just some of my other shoots where I'm in characters that I've made up. So I love wigs. I love them. Uh, they're my best friend. So go to facebook.com slash model LMC and follow me on Instagram at model LMC. And don't forget to like the page of the most amazing cosplay designer I have ever met. Her name is Katherine Fisher. Her page is Cat Designs Unlimited on Facebook. That's Cat as in the cat, the kitty, designs unlimited, three separate words. Search for that in the Facebook bar and you'll be good to go and like her page. Um, anyway, that's all I have to say. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and you all have a great day. I will update you once I have remade this costume and um, let you know how it goes. Ooh, should be fun. All right, well, I will see you all in the future, and thanks for having me. Nice to meet everybody. Bye-bye.